looks to be running around with Rob Murphy. Satanta clean possession, not sure about that handball. Across to Shield. Umpire said it's okay, and that's good from GWS. They're up and about. They've got the first. He's had a remarkable start to his career as the dogs work through Dalhouse and over the top. A chance for McCray. Now this should be Tut who can just go long. That's a terrific finish from the man that comes back into the side this afternoon. So centering ball and Wallace is marked. Outside 50. Still it continues oh. to run. Jones a big leap on the siren. And paid the mark. Oh, this is going to be really controversial. No, the mark is not paid. Well, controversial anyway because the clock seemed to run a lot, lot longer than it should have. A little bit of confusion up in the box here. There's the AFL umpires manager dealing with that. So Devon Smith just buys himself some time and around the corner it goes. Bounce out as that bounce he needed. The off in he got it. Absolutely sensational. The Giants skip away to eight. Dixon not able to. He's got good recovery. Dixon off the ground. He's pushed out of it by Hampton. He'll get the free kick. He would love a goal. So would the dogs and he delivers. So it tightens up again. Goods went searching for Dalhouse. Let go. Let go. So no change to the quarter time lead, but plenty of feeling and emotion out on this Star Trek oval. Taylor Adams at the bottom of it just a moment or two ago, and to the bottom of the pack here as well. And Cooney was actually down on the ground there for a while. I'm not quite sure what actually happened. They're not obviously casting any aspersions, but Taylor Adams has been quite fiery. to a six-point lead. Johannesson met solidly and has not moved. Looked a little nasty too. It was Jeremy Cameron that came through off the line and met him. We'll, we'll check it and see how fair that was in a moment. It's Dixon and Cordy and well, Stringer's there too. He might end up on the end of all of this and Stringer around the body bounces and it bounces beautifully. Dogs. Now to Stevens. He's going to run into trouble. He's got Wallace. He's going to use him by hand. Inside 50. Wallace. An ugly sort of a ball off the boot. It is effective nonetheless. So Davis, ball towards half forward. Yeah, the co-captain. He'll be back soon. And I tell you what, GWS deep into the third term. We're not far away from three-quarter time. He kicked two last week. He's kicking for two. And it's the same celebration. Straight off. That's a, a celebration of sorts. Can he finish it off with a goal? He steps inside 50. There'll be a marking contest or will the ball hasn't been touched. Now Cameron, he can dish the handball or go alone. Cameron has kicked his second. How does it settle? That's going to be okay. No. Yes. Holding the ball. So the dogs here from 20 out. So John Syracuse. Makes good decisions most of the time, and that is perfect. Dogs back in front. Gia has two. But the Giants through half-back. Palmer, maybe. Cameron over the top. Now Murphy. A chance, you would think. The Whitfield give was good. Can Hoskin Elliott finish late on the... He can. So suddenly we're back to within four points. The little give, they push it forward. Hampton, ugly sort of a bounce. And the Dogs get home.